When you're working with a group of individuals all in the same Word document, um, it, it can be sometimes confusing to explain to people um, where something is in the document that you're talking about. So an easy way to get around that is to add line numbers to the document, which is going to put numbers on the side here, this left uh, margin, uh, so you can say, you know, go to line 10 or line 15. All right, so that's a very easy thing to do. So if you go up to page layout within Word, and come down right here in the page setup area is this line numbers option. And so within that, there are several different types of line numbers. I'm just going to click continuous, which is going to put the line numbers so it goes all the way through the documents and where the beginning of the document is going to start with one. And then um, as the document goes on, it's going to keep counting rather than restarting every page. And so you can see all these um, lines now have line numbers. Whenever you have a table or something like this, it puts a line number at the start of the table, but not all the, the different uh, rows within a table. So those are all considered within the same line. And so you can now say, you know, go to line 70 and fix, uh, change this word do to um, something else, whatever it is. So it's a very easy way to explain somewhere where you're talking about within a document. And you can also easily turn them off by just going back to line numbers and hitting none. So that's how to use line numbers in Word. Um, you're going to have to use them oftentimes when submitting documents for review, um, say to a publisher, a journal, something like that. Um, and it's also just helpful when you're working back and forth with uh, a peer or a colleague um, trying to get a document together. So hope that was helpful. If you have any comments or questions, please put them um, below this video in the comments section and come back and watch another video. Thanks.